thoughts are too big Can I get some comfort please? I guess I should have been honest A break to my heart It's raining down baby I'm like a river that's overflowed The sooner you know it the less do we hurt Let me speak the truth You think it's too late But I can see past the rain Won't you lay it on me Turn the page and burn it Let's make up the bit Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel I hope you're all well Thank you to everyone who has already subscribed to my channel I've got over 100 subscribers now I know that might not seem a lot to some people but it's more than I expected this far I've only been doing it for a month so I thought that was really good and we've got Gary in the vlog today <laughs> if you're new here then hiya I'm Jodie sorry that the camera's wobbling all over we're in the car so today's video I just thought I'd bring you along to the pumpkin picking we've never been to pumpkin picking before have we it's no, just no. like a farm close by it's like a 20 minutes away I was thinking yeah. it was like an hour away but it's only like 20 minutes away so it's not too bad we're starting the day off quite late it's like quarter past one already and we need to get diesel as well but I'm sure we won't be there for ages but as you can see I've got my orange jumper on to match all the pumpkins <laughs> and we're gonna once we've picked our pumpkins we're gonna do another video like doing a carving competition which I will win I'm very much more creative than him I'm not even that creative but my, last time we did one I did it miles better so I won that day no I won no, Erwin was at Steve's house. Yeah, it was my mum and dad's. No, it was Steve's house. It was mum and dad's. It was Steve's house. Mum and dad's. Guaranteed it was Steve's house. It was mum and dad's, I'm and Steve was a judge. No. Yeah. Lies. See, I thought I'd just vlog today and bring you along with us. I totally lied, it's definitely not 20 minutes away, it's 40 minutes. When I read the destination on the sat nav, I read it as it was 20 miles, wasn't it? Rather than 20 minutes, and I read it as 20 minutes, so we're still not there yet. Hopefully we'll get enough time to go around and pick our own there and actually I will have a look around the farm shop as well because they usually have some real good displays so I'll try and vlog as much as I can. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your I love it! <laughs> Probably big kids that way. Look at them, should we get photos of them? Yeah, yeah, definitely. So we've been pumpkin picking. It was really cute, wasn't it? Yeah. Like practically everybody had kids, but we're our own big kids, so. <laughs> well, we've just come to the farm shop now. I think there's a little bit of a queue. We might have to wear our masks here. We'll have a look. You can find from here as well. They're all like cleaned here, aren't they? Yeah. We picked like the muddiest ones. <laughs> Ones. Oh, there's some baby ones here. We tried to look for like a really little one. And they've got all like the kits to scoop it all out. Yeah. They end up snapping though, them knives end up snapping, but we could get one for like the buckets and stuff. Yeah, then ones are three quid, you get like ghosts and stuff with it. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? 
What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. shop was cute wasn't it yeah, we just thanks. come for something to eat it's like an awkward time it's like quarter three but i've had nothing to eat all day and you've only had like a fight for breakfast haven't you so yeah. it's sort of like dinner slash tea has a heart as pure no not like yours So nice. I had lasagna and Gary had a steak and ale pie. Probably one of the best steak and ale pies I've had in like, like a long time. Nice, isn't it? Yeah, it was really nice. We've never been here before, but we'll definitely come again, won't we? Yeah, definitely. We really enjoyed that meal, didn't we? Yeah, it was lovely. Yeah. I had a pint of stromba and Gary had a pale ale. Just realised how frizzy my hair's gone. Don't stay straight for long at all. But yeah, we'll just pop into my mum and dad's for a cup of tea. I might actually get her to do me a gin. Gary can have a cup of tea, I'll have a gin. It's weekend after all. Definitely having a gin. They've all ordered Chinese, but I'm not hungry yet, so I'm just gonna enjoy my gin. And I think we're gonna watch a horror movie. We're ready to watch a film. I borrowed some PDAs off my mama. Which is all comfy cozies. How you doing, Lynn? Some whores in this house. Uh, all set for a movie, guys! Uh, <laughs> my mum in there. I. <laughs> I might have some crispies. What film are we watching? No, no, is that what we're watching? You're gonna get scared, Dad. My dad gets real scared, don't you? <laughs> Oh, it's like when you're at the cinema and everyone's chuckling and you want everyone to shut up because you're watching a film. <laughs> I wish you'd all shut up. <laughs> what? <laughs> I realised I didn't end the vlog yesterday, so it's Sunday now. Um, it got quite late when we left my mum and dad, so uh, I thought I'd just carry on the vlog today. We're going to a little market. Uh, about 20 minutes away from us and then we're just going to Poundland so I thought I'd just carry on and do a, like a full weekend vlog. First though, my mum and dad are coming for tea. Ah, everything's falling out of the fridge. I'm going to put a gammon in this slow cooker for tea later. If everything don't want to keep falling out of the fridge. I've got them lashes on again today, like the ones that I bought for my bargains. I thought they was going to be like quite natural but they're quite big and fluffy but I really like them so I'm addicted to them now. As soon as you start wearing eyelashes, like when I don't wear eyelashes, I feel like my eyes just look so weird. So I can't like not wear them now. If you're interested, the um, eyelashes are Eyelio, they're like the Jade Wood collection. If I can find a link to them, I'll link them in the description box. <coughs> We're here at the market. We've got our masks at the ready. We're here to get some towels, like we got some Egyptian towels last time and they're really nice. Like they wash real well and stuff, so we're going to get some of them. And Gary's hoping to get like a pork and apple sandwich. It's his tradition whenever he comes to a market. <laughs> That bag suits your dad. <laughs> we just popped into Aldi for a few bits. We did do a food shop last week that was going to last us like two weeks, but we needed like potatoes and a couple of other bits that I didn't realise I needed. So we're just off to Poundland now. So if there's anything exciting in there, like Halloween or Christmassy bits, then I'll show you. We're in like a pound shop. It's called like Wombler, but yeah, it's like a pound shop. But got loads of beauty products. I've just got this um, nail polish remover, the Aston Free stuff, because it's good for the uh, when you do gel nails. But look at all like, the makeup brushes and stuff they've got. Got quite a lot of beauty stuff, haven't they? Yeah. And the eyelashes. And the baskets are real nice as well. They're only a pound as well. I love them pink ones. Can't go wrong for a quid, can you? Look at all 
all the pink and grey kitchen things. I love them whisks. Anything pink and I'm just a sucker for it, aren't I? Mm. What is it I wanted? A sieve. Oh, that's a, that's a sieve anyway, isn't it? That, mm. It's just like a flat one. That's weird. Oh, that little one's cute. I'm going to get that one instead. A pound for a mug. They're really nice as well. All the baking stuff. I've noticed as well I always say stuff. It's annoying me. <laughs> All the candles. Is that actually Yankee as well? Look at them, 79p. Yankee. Some That's really good, isn't it? The wax melt ones. Oh, Christmas ones. Get in. Sold. Got all the Halloween bits. There's still quite a lot in here, isn't they? I thought most of it would be sold out by now. It's like, uh, it's still two weeks ago, isn't they? Mm -hmm. Oh, like a little ghost. Yeah. Now we're in Poundland. This is the Halloween things that they've got in here. I like them little plates. Cute. I like the boo plates I've seen on the picture outside. There's the boo napkins that I want. I ain't seen them that yet. Oh, there's miles more things down this aisle. And you notice I've tried to stop saying stuff and they say things. <laughs> it was just at the beginning, so it was only a little bit. But there's miles more stuff down here. If you can see the napkins, there they are. I'm such a big kid, aren't I? <laughs> I thought these things looked real nice for like three. Well, that's like five pound, and that's that plant's real nice. It's only three pound. So real nice stuff. And the grass. This sort of gold is like in at the minute, isn't it? Mm. So we're back home now. I've just made a start on the Sunday roast. I've got the gammon in the slow cooker, but I just thought I'd show you what we picked up from the market and from Poundland. So, like I said earlier, we wanted some um, new bath towels. So. We've got a real good deal on these Egyptian cotton towels. We've got like a creamy colour, it sort of like matches my jumper, but we got two large like bath towels and then two hand towels and that was all £20, which I think is really good for like really good quality towels. So that's why we always go to the market to get them. And then we just got like strawberries and olives and like random bits and Gary got some foot insoles. So that was all from the market. And then from Poundland, so the, we went in the one below shop, which is like a Poundland and, and a Poundland as well. I can't actually remember what's from what, but this is actually from Poundland because it says Pep and Co. So we needed a bath mat and we haven't found one for ages and we need one because every time we get a shower, it like soaks the floor. So we just got this one and it just matches the towels. Well, slightly. This is These are a little bit more cream. That's like more white, but for £3, I thought that was really nice and it's really soft. So even if it doesn't last long, I thought that's like quite a good price for, for what it is. And then Gary's been having a bad knee, so he's just got like a knee support. I got some ibuprofen. Then Gary just got some pens for work. It's not an exciting haul, that's why I just thought I'd put it at the end of this vlog. Um, so I needed some wooden spoons, so I just got this three pack for a pound. You just get like the spatula one, like normal wooden spoon. And then ones with just like the gaps in the middle. So it was three for a pound. So I needed a new sieve, so I just got this cute little pink one. That was only 79p. So I just got that to do my cupcakes. And I did a banana loaf a few weeks ago, which I'm going to do again. Then I saw these, like loaf tin liners. I thought they was quite good. It's just better than your cake sticking to the tin. I got those. Obviously, they was only a pound. And then instead of using like my notepads for a shopping list, I just got this little notepad for my shopping list. I thought it was cute. It's got little polka dots on it. That was only a pound. I don't really need to say, unless it's not a pound, I don't really need to say how much it all is. So. Um, I wanted some napkins to go when we have like the cupcakes and stuff, so... I got those little ghost ones. I thought they were really cute. I know you can't really call Halloween cute, but they are cute. <laughs> I call everything cute. And then I was looking for some like little plastic spiders. I couldn't find anywhere. It was just the spider. So I found this, where it's like an orange cobweb with a little plastic spider inside of it. So I thought I'd get that. I'm gonna do like a little display in my all way with the pumpkins that we got yesterday. So if you follow my Instagram, Jodie's Home Sweet Home, I'll be putting like pictures on like my little displays and stuff. So make sure you go and follow me on Instagram. It's not just home stuff. Like I started that Instagram because it's called Jodie's Home Sweet Home. I started that Instagram as a home account, but now I just put like everything on there. Like in my stories, I put like my dead day life and like selfies and things like that on it now. So, and then I just got a new toothbrush. Not very exciting. And then Halloween again, I saw this skull. I thought it was quite pretty. It's like full of glitter. I saw like a silver one, but in my hallway, like I said, I was going to do the display in my hallway and it's got like, it's like golds and rose golds in there. So I thought the silver one probably won't look nice. I thought the black one would and black is obviously more Halloween-y. So I thought that was really nice. 
And then I just got some white wine vinegar. I always descale my kettle with this. It always descales the kettle real good. And then I said when I was in the shop, but I've just got this nail polish remover. It's the acetone free one. So when I gel my nails, it like takes off the tackiness of it. It doesn't actually take off the gel. But you can also use it to take off normal nail varnish as well. And then I showed you in the shop as well, they were selling the Yankee Candle wax melts for 79p, which I thought was really good. Because normally they're like, I'm sure they're more than one pound. So I got four of the Glittering Star ones, because I love that one for Christmas. I want to actually get the full, the full jar one, but I got four of those Glittering Star ones. At 79p each. And then I got two of the Frosted Gingerbread ones. They smell real nice. That's like a proper cinnamon -y one, that one. This Glittering Star one actually smells like, it reminds me of like an aftershave. I really like that one as well. Yeah, that frosted gingerbread one is like cinnamony. So that was everything we bought today. So mum and dad are coming around for a roast and then we're just going to chill out in the hot tub for the rest of the night. So I'll end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching and coming along with us this weekend. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll leave a link to my Instagram if you want to go follow me on there, Jodie Tom Sweet Home. Thanks for watching. Bye.